Well, today I'm talking, I guess, particularly to our graduates, but it's a message for all of us. I wore my shirt from one of my alma maters, which I'm very proud of. There's a lot that I learned while I was there. And there's a lot that our graduates have learned from whatever school or institution you may have graduated from that will prepare you for what is yet to come. But there's a scripture that I think is wisdom to live by. It comes from 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 7. For we live by faith, not by sight. And I think in this situation, faith re refers to our relationship with God. And so I challenge our graduates in particular, but all of us really, to live by faith, live by a relationship with God, live knowing that the God of the universe created us, that God, through the death of his son, Jesus Christ on the cross, showed us how crazy in love with us he is and how much he cares about us. And to understand that God knows all things and understands and knows the future and the plan that he has for us. And when we live that way, when we live understanding who God is, it makes a difference in our everyday life. So that's the way I hope we choose to live. And in, instead of by sight, I think by sight is talking more about what we can see, what we can know. There are a lot of things we can't know about our future. A lot of things we can't know about even our own potential. And for you graduates in particular, I encourage you not to be satisfied with just what you know about yourself and what you know you can do, but reach for those things that sometimes seem unreachable. And when you allow God to be a part of that, you will be amazed at what's attainable. So once again, I close with this, 2 Corinthians 5, 7, for we live by faith, not by sight. Go and live that way.